Hi, uh, this video is about uh, Microsoft Visio, how to change the background. So let me open the new file here. So I'm opening the new file uh, and then I'm going to pick the general here. You can pick any um, any template, but I'm going to pick the general here. Uh, let's see, uh, basic diagram in US unit. Okay. So let me insert the page here. And I want to uh, insert this page in a landscape type so I will select the landscape here okay uh, and I will get rid of this page here let me make the size of the page 75 uh, let's say 100 percent here okay uh, it's too big I just want to okay let's put 85 okay that should be okay so now uh, to change the background here um, you can find the background on the shape here another way you can go here is the uh, file shapes and then extras with the extras and here you can find the background here okay so I can select this one as well so now to change this background um, you can just drag let's say I want to put the solid background here so I can just drag and drop so now it's solid here uh, I can pick the background with the stripes here so now it is showing with the stripes and when you put the background um, this uh, page will be inserted automatically here uh, let's say I want to put the world map here on the background so you can see now it's uh, showing the world map on the background here okay so that's the way you insert the background okay another way is to uh, let's say you want to install the custom base background so what I have done here is that you can uh, take any picture or you can find the image and then um, you want to use that image as a background so I already have copied one rose image so let me open that one here so I will go here file uh, shapes my shapes and is in my favorite here so this is the rose image I want to use as a background so uh, before I do that let me get rid of this um, background image first so I will go here background and when I put the background none here uh, it will get rid of the original background okay and now that uh, page has been deleted as well so now to create the custom background I will go in the favorites uh, this is the image that I have uh, already uh, selected here uh, you, I can just drag and drop here and then I can uh, I can resize it here for now so now uh, first thing I, I will create uh, one background page here so you can go here and uh, insert page okay. now once you insert the page um, you don't select the foreground you need to select the background here okay and I can give a name let's say red rose and uh, I can say uh, click OK and now that create the red rose here okay now I can just uh, cut this rose image I can put it here okay and this will be my background now you can um, format this image as well so let's say I select this image okay uh, format the picture here and I can let's say I want to uh, leave very transparent image in my background size okay so now now this will be my uh, background image in the rows so let's say now if I want to create a new page here so I say insert page and then here now I want to see the rows background so you go here in the background and select the red rows okay. so click OK and uh, there you go now this page page number two it is inserted with the rows background here and uh, same way you can insert the new pages as well so let's say if I go here insert page I will leave as a it will leave as a red rose as a default and now page number three again that will be the same background image as, as of a rose here okay so uh, that's how you can insert the background one by using the template that is provided with the Microsoft Visio and, s and second one you can insert your own custom made images as well okay uh, hopefully you like this video 
if you like it subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching okay bye